Hey everyone, I'm Joseph Christina. In this quick video, I'm going to show you exactly how to set up your camera to automatically add the author and copyright information to all your photos. Most modern camera bodies allow copyright information to be baked into the XF data upon image capture. In some cases, this information can be added directly through the back panel of your camera, while in others require the camera to be tethered to a computer and the manufacturer provided software used. Instead of using one of our Canon 5D Mark IIs in studio, which requires the EOS utility software, I'm going to use a Canon 7D as it provides direct access via the rear panel. Bear in mind, the method of entering copyright information varies from manufacturer to manufacturer and even from camera body to camera body. So check your user manual for specific instructions. So let's get started. After pressing the menu button on the back of your camera, you'll see a row of options. Select the last yellow menu option at the top. This sub-menu allows you to view battery information, button options, user settings, firmware version, and most importantly, what we're interested in, copyright information. Once selected, you'll be brought to another sub-menu. This menu gives you the ability to display copyright information, enter author's name, enter copyright details, or delete all copyright information. Let's start out with enter author's name. You will see an input screen appear with a series of alphanumeric characters. Using the camera's control dial or toggle button, simply type in your name as you would like it displayed. Here's a tip. If you make a mistake, don't worry. You don't have to start over. Simply press the trash can button on the back of the camera as it acts as the delete key on your keyboard. Once you're done entering the author's name, hit your menu button once again. The information is saved and you'll be brought back to the previous menu. Now select the next option called Enter Copyright Details. For this demo, I'll enter contact author at jchristina.com, but you may want to enter all rights reserved, your phone number, the physical address of your studio, or possibly even your email address. The sky's the limit, it's completely up to you. Once again, when you're happy with the information you've entered, simply hit the menu button to save and return to the previous menu. To verify that everything was saved properly, simply select Display Copyright Information. Here you can see Author Joseph Christina. Copyright Contact Author at jchristina.com. To sum up, most modern camera bodies allow copyright information to be directly added to an image upon capture. This information can be added directly from the back of your camera or indirectly using a manufacturer provided software. Even though many online sites as well as various methods of saving photos can strip XF data from your image, in most cases the copyright information fields remain intact. By setting up your camera to automatically add this information will not only prove ownership of a photo, if ever in question, but may also help recover a lost memory card or even a stolen camera. So, if your camera gives you the ability to add copyright information, do it now. You'll thank me later, I promise you. Alright everyone, if you enjoyed the video, please hit that like button. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for future photographic tips, tricks, how-tos, and reviews. I'm Joseph Christina, and if you'd like to follow me, you can do so on Twitter, that's at Joseph Christina, and that's Christina without an H. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you next time.